the man of all virtue in Toro. Hi, I'm Vikas Sani of the Python.com, and tonight we are going to review this lovely six inches by 50 ringgit stick. And the cigar is really well made, very spongy in taste, very sturdy. It is, I'm told, uh, is a AJ Fernandez brand. Uh, the, the the wrapper is Connecticut, Ecuadorian Connecticut. A little bit of a tear here and there in the cigar, as you can see, but really tight construction. Um, really spongy feel to it doesn't feel too tight so i don't think so there will be any problems in the draw uh, apart from that uh, the veins are very minimal and whatever the veins are they are a little bit prominent but not much so and let's say there's only like 20 percent of the veins which are there uh, the cap is double which is really good i don't like single capped um, cigars uh, really interesting artwork as well on the band as you can see it's a Spartan, that's why the man of war, half man, half god. Uh, so let's slide it up and see how it goes for the first one third of the cigar. I'll be back in a second. Let's slide up the cigar. I've actually cut it. Wow, my sorry, I forgot my cigar lighter at office. Actually, I've been smoking a stick or two small cigarillos at office. Uh, as you know, uh, uh, the build my company whom I work for they basically have changed uh, buildings they've now moved on to a bigger building but the problem is the building is fireproof so we really uh, I can't really smoke pipes or cigars there um, for a longer time you have to basically go out and uh, take your smoke break but whatever we always improvise so First off, it's really light hay aroma coming in. The taste is really smooth. Um, you don't feel any harshness or any other flavor other than the tobacco, uh, the, the, the hay aroma coming in basically. Uh, not really that long of a finish. Uh, if, you've, if, you're in, if you are a regular uh, cigar review uh, viewer, you'll see that it's a little bit of a different experience than uh, uh, in the case of a torpedo because the torpedo had a longer finish in other videos you can go check out Brian Glenn's uh, video as well on the cigar so let's carry on and see how it fares um, in the first third so I'll be back in a second 20 minutes into the smoke we are almost at the one third point of the smoke as you can see a razor sharp burn there, there are no issues in the burn very nice and smell draw uh, as you can see the ash is quite tight don't worry about that uh, angle of the ash I accidentally nicked it over so the, the ash is really good uh, very tight uh, don't think so it will fall over but I'm just going to tip it over uh, because of my uh, mistake just a minute uh, anyways the taste profile has more or less remained remained the same. Uh, the, 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 the irritation or the uncomfortableness I was talking about the cigar is actually the pepper zing. The pepper is really strong in this one, but surprisingly it doesn't come out at the front of your mouth, but rather it stays in the background. So I think that was the thing which was uh, making, you know, I was not able to identify it properly. So this cigar is really mild. Uh, not much transit not much in the in terms of transition uh, oh, sorry it's basically um, the taste is basically um, hay aroma a little bit of a Vegemite vibe going on you know cauliflower kind of a thing and a little bit of uh, the pepper zing if you are a pipe smoker you'll you you'll understand what I'm talking about uh, of course uh, the cigar smokers uh, definitely for follow what I'm trying to say so a little bit of a berry coming in in terms of pepperiness but there's no other thing very un uh, uncomplicated uh, smoke 
no burn issues, uh, nothing of that sort. Uh, but not the complexity uh, usually what I look for in a cigar. Not saying this is a bad cigar, it's a really nice smoke for someone who is new to the cigar smoking um, uh, hobby. Uh, but I am not finding it that interesting in terms of complexities and transitions. Overall, a good smoke. Um, let's smoke it out and I'll be back at the halfway point. 40 minutes into the smoke, we are almost at the halfway point of the cigar. Uh, nothing much have transitioned or changed in terms of uh, body and strength of the cigar. Um, though I'm, quite, I'm beginning to feel that uh, it's a little bit ramping up in terms of strength. Uh, basically, when we talk about body and strength, body is basically the taste of the cigar and strength is the nicotine content in it. Uh, what I'm uh, getting here is uh, lighter body. The, the flavors are not that much. It's a very simple uh, single direction cigar with lots of pepper and uh, typical hay aroma, hay taste to it. Uh, but definitely uh, in, the, in the strength department, it is now moving from mild uh, towards, uh, almost towards the medium strength. If you are, uh, if you are into cigars which are a little bit higher in nicotine content, but not actually full bodied, uh, sorry, full strength, uh, this is the stick for you. Uh, somehow, I'm not comfortable in smoking the cigar. Of course, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll finish this up just for you guys, uh, but I'm not getting much vibes from this thing. And I love my cigars, uh, uh, you know, uh, some something is off with the stick. Maybe uh, it didn't have much time in the humidor. I would, I should have actually, you know, kept it a little bit more longer um, in a little bit of humidor. I and mean, maybe the, the the leaves used in this batch of the cigars, which came um, in the box, uh, was a little off. But something is not right. I don't usually read blogs or see videos of the cigars I actually smoke. You know, the first time I've smoked, I, I don't want my opinion to be biased. But I actually talked when I when I went to get the cigar. I actually talked to someone who actually had smoked it. Um, I was told it was sweet. I don't detect any sweetness in it. And uh, apart from cigar smoking, I'm also a pipe smoker. So I actually my tongue is used to detect uh, different subtleties in the blend or complexity in the blend uh, this is more of um, a beginner cigar you can say i'm not saying the mad the entire man of war series is is like that because man of war um, if you look at the other uh, cigars they make they are fantastic but for me i'm a little biased i tend to gravitate towards maduro's um, cigars with more transitions and flavors I like full bodied, uh, medium strength cigars. This is more of a light body and medium uh, strength cigar. So in terms of nicotine, I'm okay. Uh, it's giving me a little buzz as you can see, as you can say. Uh, but in terms of body, uh, I'm not getting much. Uh, would you smoke this thing if you are in India? I don't know. I leave that decision up to you. But at the price point of $16, I don't think so. I'll be smoking it again. But let's uh, move towards the, uh, the I think, uh, the second, third point. And uh, I'll be back to report what I find in, in this journey of the cigar. Um, sorry, guys. I'm a little off uh, with this cigar. Uh, but this is my honest review. I just want, to, want you to know what my experience is with this stick. So I'll be back in a few minutes and report what I find in the second third of the cigar. 70 minutes into the smoke, we are at actually at the end point for the cigar. Um, the, the ash actually just fell off on the table I'm smoking on. Um, anyways, um, nothing much in terms of change or transitions. It's a really straight uh, 
a single uh, profile smoke um, not sure if I should recommend it I just leave it to your uh, you know judgment um, but for me I would not be smoking this one again um, I like it it has the pepper zing but apart from that not much doesn't have much I'm more of a complex cigar kind of a guy uh, slow burning still lots of it left but I will end my smoke here and I hope you enjoyed this video something was a little off with the cigar and that put my mind in, in you know into a little bit of an off balance um, this has been Man of War Virtue in Toro I hope you like the cigar um, if you tend to smoke it um, give it a try actually just don't believe what everyone else including me says everyone has a different uh, you know reaction and experience with whether it be cigar or a pipe pipe tobacco or anything else so give it a try see how it goes if you like simple um, uh, you know light bodied uh, medium strength cigars this might be the one for you until uh, then light up your world and light up your cigar see ya